Hi Java developers, I'm Shahin Shah. In this tutorial, I'm going to explain you how to use Selenium WebDriver in Java. What is Selenium? Selenium is a testing framework which is used to test the web applications. So with the Selenium, we can test all the web applications on the web browsers on different across the different uh, web browsers. How to do that with the help of uh, Java? So here, what to do? The first things. First thing is to download the Selenium jars and then if you are going to use Firefox, Chrome or IE then download those uh, drivers. I'm, in this tutorial I am going to use Chrome driver so I am going to download the Chrome driver so that Selenium can uh, talk to the Chrome driver and invoke the Chrome browser. Next I am going to create a Java project. Java project and I am going to write a class which which uses the selenium interfaces and classes and methods so that uh, we can uh, invoke the chrome browser and test whatever we is required so this is just an introduction to the selenium web driver usage in java so let us go ahead and download it so first thing is to download the selenium jars in chrome driver so how where to download the selenium jars you can download it at uh, selenium hq.org so let us go try and download this so we are going to use java so we have to download this uh, java related selenium jars so i have downloaded it and i have already placed it. So these are the selenium jars. So these are the selenium jars. The next step is to download the chrome driver. I have downloaded my machine is windows and I have downloaded the chrome driver for windows and I have unzipped it. And this is the chrome driver exe. Now let us go ahead and create a project in Eclipse. I am going to create a new java project and let me name as selenium demo. I have finished it and the first thing is to add the libraries or jar files to the build path. So add an external jars. So first thing is go to selenium directory. There are two selenium jars. Add them and then add all the jar files in lib. So I am adding all the jar files and I am saying ok. So I have added all the jar files into selenium demo project. Now let me go ahead and create a package. Let it be selenium demo. I have created a package. Now I am going to create a class. So let me name it as selenium demo. So a class has been uh, created. And right now, let us write a main method. And now the first thing is uh, you have to create a web driver. So in order to do that first you have to import some of the selenium packages here. So import org dot selenium. Let me copy paste those things. So these are the jar files which I have these are the packages which I have already used. So these are the 
packages selenium web driver web element and chrome driver chrome driver is to invoke the chrome browser the second thing let me copy paste the things to save the time and i will i am going to explain those let me format the output okay the first thing which i have uh, did is we have created a web driver and the web driver is chrome driver and we have uh, driver dot get we have we will be assigning the google dot com as the url to that driver and then we are going to have a web element which is added to that url which is a queue and then we are going to add some key to it so actually what this program does it searches for shahenshah in google after opening the chrome browser so here it is showing an error let me let me it suggests for close i have added it there are no more errors so after doing this all we have to add a system set property which actually takes care of this chrome browser or chrome driver so where is the chrome driver we have installed i have installed the chrome driver at this location so i have copy pasted the location of the chrome driver so that it can identify the chrome driver and invoke the chrome browser so to do this you should have a chrome browser and you have to download a chrome driver and you should download all the selenium jar files so what this program does it creates a web driver and uh, it invokes the chrome driver and it calls the chrome browser and then loads google.com and searches for shahenshah so this thread not sleep is just to keep it active for few seconds as i am uh, finally closing the driver so driver dot quit so let us go ahead and run this i am running it as a java application so you can see that uh, chrome browser has been opened oh i have given it as google.co.in/maps so this is the wrong url let us change the url here it is showing driver.get selenium demo 26 sorry i have uh, ran the wrong project let me run the right project so this is the project which we have created now right now so i am going to java running it as a java application so you can see that the chrome browser has been invoked and google.com is opened as it is uh, local then it is showing google.co.in and now uh, it has to give a query string as shahenshah let us wait it yes it has been given and it has been searched now it will be closed automatically as i have written driver dot quit so thread dot sleep for 5 seconds so it is taking 5 seconds to wait and then it is quitting it. so this is how for we test the websites with the help of selenium web driver in java let us try another example of creating the maps so let me take the driver and then i'm going to give it as slash maps slash places slash hyderabad and then i'm giving a thread dot sleep so let us go ahead run the program again let us see what happens so this time it has to show max after uh, having the search so search google.com has been opened the first thing and then it has to search for shahenshah and then it has to open max i have given the wrong url so it is showing response code 404 and it has been quit so let us check out what is the url for uh, maps google.com/maps 
slash base slash Okay, this is the correct URL. Let me go ahead and give the URL here. It's not places, it's place. I'm taking it, I'm saving it, and then running it again. So it is opened in Chrome browser and it will search for Shahenja and then it should wait for 5 seconds and then go ahead with the maths. Google Maps has opened and Hyderabad location is shown. So similarly you can do other operations in inside the website and with the Chrome. And we can also do this with the, uh, with the other browsers like IE and Firefox. So this is a, just a small example. Hope that is explainable and uh, easy. Thank you.